Hey, how are you doing? I'm Gio. Welcome to the channel, or hopefully welcome back, because we're in episode 2 of This is England 88, episode 2 of 3, or 3 in the series, well, as part of the series, right? This is England 88, and then This is England 90. This comes after This is England 86, right? So, we had quite a time jump, right? Quite a lot changed between um, 86 and 88, right? Two short years, but I had changed massively. Um, we've got LOL. LOL is struggling to cope as a single mother to Milky's baby. So I'm guessing that sometime after 86, I wouldn't imagine they kept going, right? After Harry and Woody, at the end of 86, Harry and Woody sort of made up and they were going to try. But I guess at a point she was already pregnant. And then when it comes out that it's Milky's, everything changed, right? So Although it's Milky's baby, she doesn't necessarily want a relationship with Milky. Milky's trying a little bit to be like a supportive, I guess, but she doesn't really want him to be support. Maybe the guilt, right? Maybe the guilt is pushing him away from her or making her push him away. Maybe the guilt of what she had and what she lost, right? And then at the other side of what we've got um, Woody, who's gone from the punk rock skinhead chick to the I don't even know how to describe her right she's like um sundresses and bubbly and smiley and probably doesn't swear and you know gets on really well with his parents and and Woody's dying inside right you can tell he's he's, he's playing along with us charade at home he's got with his mom and his dad and his girlfriend and he's playing along but he's dying inside, mate. It's, it's not how he wants to be. And it's because he seems to have chosen the furthest thing from law he could find. Right? He's gone completely opposite in the spectrum from law. Probably because she hurt him so badly. So he's distanced himself from girls like her. Right? Um, as far as I know, Combo Song Prison, had I seen him? I guess that's a part of... Uh, Laws regrets as well, right? Like, for happening, it's got to impact her fucking deeply, right? Combo's in prison because of her. Not that she's mentioned it, but, you know, it's got to affect her. And it looks like, it looks like she's on good terms with her mother again. Like, her mother, the person who invited the abuser back into their lives again, and then chose him over law again. But now he's dead, and she's a... Uh, happy families, right? To the extent that the kid, Law's kid, is playing in the room where Law murdered Mick, right? Which is fucking weird, mate. It really is. Um, and it never gets mentioned. Law's had all about flashbacks. Law's had all about flashbacks we know again. A trauma's coming through. First of all, I missed. That's about it, right? Um, Milky came back and it was a bit frosty, right? He's trying to be one of the boys again. He's trying to get him with a gun again. It's a bit frosty, as expected, because I guess it takes two to tango, but he betrayed Woody, right? So Milky's still kind of part of the gang. Woody has distanced himself completely. Woody, he goes out in his, his vest, but he says he's got a lot of work. Just to get out the fucking house. Oh. He goes to the pub. He's looking at the window, looking at all his friends or ex-friends having fun. He's smiley, he's happy for them, and he sees Milky, and he leaves in disgust, right? And it looks like, like they've chosen Milky over him, right? Even though it seems like he walked away from them, it seems like there's no consequences for Milky, right? You just keep going, Milky. Sing your karaoke, mate. So it's um, it's, I was, it's episode one, I think, covered. Mate, hopefully this gets fucking happier. Oh, about a comic relief. We need more gadget, right? We need something a bit happier. This is getting depressing. And I know it's supposed to be. I know it's supposed to be. It's Shane Meadows. It's like life, you know? It's outside of life, but fuck me. But it's still good. It's still great. Um, this is episode... Oh, Sean. Sean in Smell or Saligither, but not for long, probably, because he's got his eye on somebody else. A girl is a college way. He's doing acting. Oh, and Mrs. Sean and Sandu are still together. So that's good. I mean, Sandu's a nice guy. She's lonely, you know. Yeah. So this is, um, this is episode two. Oh, oh wow. Look at him skating. He's going fast. He has. He's going very, very fast. 
very fast. Whee! He's running. Auntie, let's find the swings. Are you sure you don't mind having it today? No, of course. I just don't want to feel like I'm dumping it on you. No. It's fine. I'm in a that I've forgotten about. And it's okay, mate. You'd have to, like, look at People are happy to help you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 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 Is she going back to her house? Is she going to go back to the house? Lol, you fucker. She needs to shave her head again, get blonde, just just for the the make herself feel better, right? Sean, what the fuck? What are you doing? Are you wanking? Jesus, You're Sean. Sean. Oh, that is gross. My God. Okay, sure, you've got a woolen partner in bed, mate. You've got a woolen partner right here. Under pressure with a plane and stuff, and it, you know, with all that. Well, I'll see you at the play later, yeah? Mm. Oh, so, Sean. I'm being there, let's get changed, by the way. It's a bit intense, isn't it? Does it not feel unnatural to be sat like that? Oh, it's slightly, don't we? Where'd you get to last night? Send a fax. Send a fax. Oh, I told you I was sending a fax. Send a fax. Well, I forgot to send, but it was machines buggering me about. A long time, son. Man's in his 30s, man. Fuck me. The guy's in his 30s. Leave him alone. Nearly 25. Well, 25, okay, 25. Because yeah. I have no mates. Well, I, I'm not cheating on you, you with didn't say friend. that. Alright. said anything about that. Alright, well, look. I can only go as fast as the fax machine will allow me to it go. It was after 20 past 12 when you came in that door. It's 25, mate. It's 25. Oh. Marine, oh, she can box the yard. Okay. I'm oh, sorry to just turn up like this. It's okay. You got to apologise first, though. Yesterday, you said. You got to apologise, though, first. Say sorry. Of course. Say sorry first. Of course. Have you been if you slept? Why did nurses stop wearing those stupid fucking black capes? I apologise about yesterday. I vaguely remember him. I'm glad you've come in. No, it was... It was awful the way I spoke to you. It was. It really was. It's understandable you're under a lot of pressure. No, it just... I need you to know that I'm really Yeah, let her apologise. Just let her apologise. Have you ever spoken to anyone about it? Yeah. I've got a friend then. But no, you don't. He's not around at the minute. Yeah, I know you don't have a friend. Like, fucking. He's always been there for me. Yeah. Who so? Milky, obviously. Or, like, what? It's absolutely not something you should carry around. It can destroy a person. Yeah, can I destroy it hard? No. It is. Did I tell you I killed him though? Fuck's sake. Did I tell you I killed him? Like what? I murdered him with a hammer. Smashy skull in. And you haven't had a chance to deal with it properly. And because you're not at peace. I'll never be at peace. I can never be at peace. You can. I can't. Almost my eyes. It's a nice surprise. Did she never visit him often? You think she would? If you would. Okay. So, Phil. Yeah. Yeah, good. Yep. Is it going alright? Yeah. Yeah. Thing is, it's it, at least you, you can sort of you can sort of live with the fact that he's in her for the right reason, right? He's in her for near the right reason because he shouldn't have done it. Um, a good reason, right? Is there for a good reason? Only pitches. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I think I've got them all right. Look at Combos, though. 
like a genuine smile. White mom, block baby, and combos are actually happy. It's changed, right? It's changed, big time. He looks like Milky and he's laughing. He's happy about it. How's Woody? Um, Fucking with me, yeah, I see him. Fine, he's got a new girlfriend. How would you case fine though? He's not fine. He's far from fine. How are you? Shite. Um, Terrible. Depressed. Things are hard. But I'm getting there. Look at her. Telling the guy who's in prison for something she did that things are hard. The ball's on it. The ball's on it. I just really wanted to come and say thank you face to face. Oh, you don't have to thank me. No, she does. She does. She Every fucking day she me. should be thanking you. Every day. Yeah, I know you would. She should be thanking you because, well, she not wouldn't just, have got, well, would she? Would she have got to prison for it? Not just that. I remember when you came and saw me at the factory. We had that chat in the car. This is England movie. And I said, said some things that I really regret. Don't remember. Don't remember. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do, mate. You do. We talked about that night that we had together. The night we had together. Mm. You were saying it was the best night of your life. Mm. And she said it was the worst of hers, by the way. And I said she it, said it was, was the worst night of my life. Yeah. <coughs> mm. But it wasn't. No, no one's ever been that gentle with me. Eh? Ah. Of course it was the worst night of our life, like our dad and stuff, you know. You've always been there for me. You know a lot about me, about my past. Mm. You're sat there and I'm sat here. Yeah, it's it's awful. Awful. I just want to say thank you. Oh. Oh. I love you. Oh. Oh, combo. I think I think I should be missing combo's life, right? Like no dad. I'm sure his mom tried her best, but you know. I'm gonna have to go. I've got to go and get Lisa, and she's at my mom's. I said. You say it's like. See her today. So. Doing stuff for other people without doing stuff for himself, right? Even even the far right stuff, even the national front stuff was like, you're still doing stuff for other people. People up here, you're being the foot soldier. You're doing stuff for them. You're needing stuff for you. I couldn't see you again. God needs to do stuff I, every fucking week, every week, at least. I've got Christmas. Happy Christmas. So then picture your boobs and stuff like that. Keep them going. Look at her though, she's made his day, she, she really has. It's okay. It's okay. Mm. Love you. Mm. Love you. Oh. Yeah, you soppy bastards, go off for a cry. Jesus Christ. Hello. 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 Why has he got a suit and tie on? Well, a suit. Why has he got a suit on? Where's he going? He's not got to play. He's not got to lol. Oh, that's a... Breaks my heart. Yeah. Oh, honest to God, you've done such a good job with her. Yeah. You think? You really yeah. have both. She's amazing. And what the... What, what has happened with your mum? <laughs> I yeah. Just turned a corner, that's what I thought we were That is not the Chrissy I, I know, definitely. Oh, you mean? Oh, 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 o
that? How's that arm? Is it all right? Yeah. Where's my lovely Angela? Who the fuck? Who's that fucker? <laughs> Who are you? Not Angela. No, Not Angela. Where's Angela? Yeah. Come here, hey? And you must be Jennifer. Yeah. Twice as lovely as he said you were, eh? Right? <laughs> if such a thing were possible. Oh, <laughs> mm, oh Jesus Christ. Bonjour. Hello. Nice to meet you. My name's Shannon. Oh, hello, Where's Angela? Who's Angela? Uh, Angela and I are, uh, we've, um, you know, it's a okay. bit of a rocky road. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, I I'm know. sorry. It's been a bit hard, hasn't it, Ken? Don't much spiral. I can see yeah. that, right. I mean, I won't have a bad word said about Angela, I'll be do you honest know, with you. Do you know Angela? Oh, yeah, no, I've cut her hair for about six years You've now. You've got a hair as well. Yeah, no, so you're a hairdresser? You're a hairdresser? You're a hairdresser, wow. Yeah. Really, really wow, amazing. Wow, amazing. He was just helping him like with his Mars problems, right? Yeah. Giving you promotion? Oh, oh no. Oh no. No, because oh, no. he's not everybody. Because he's not accepting it. Because he's not accepting it. You see, the thing is, Janice, you see, Rich has not put pen to paper. Yet, no. But we don't want to frighten him off. Do we? Signed it yet, you <laughs> stupid cunt, have I? <laughs> worky fucking. I'm doing worky banter. Worky banter. <laughs> I'm just going to go and wish him good luck. All right, love. All right. Yeah, tell him Maria. Tell him we're rooting for him. Oh, she, she's near a walk-in, is she? Is she going to walk in? Oh. Oh. Oh, oh no. Let go. Let go. Let go. Quick. Let go. How's behind your back? Can. Fuck me. So close if you love me. Oh, God. What are you kissing? Practicing. Senpai. Rehearsing. Well, it looked really real. Mm. Good job. How are you here? Very realistic. She came to say good luck, mate. She's not a dickhead. Luck, yeah, she was being nice. Well, you, wish well, you were stabbing on the back. We just need to get on the barriers also. Will you go, please? Can you go, please? Go. Fucking hell, mate. I don't really want you here. And I don't mean it in a nasty way. I mean it as in, we need to get on with our ears. He's just been caught cheating and he's in the water here. The balls are a little one. Jesus. How is he, darling? Fucking horrible. Oh. He's just nervous, love. See that though? See that name making a big deal before the play starts? That's a good... That's a nice one. If she doesn't want to put him under stress before the play starts. Because tonight, what's mine is yours. You're in my place of worship tonight. What a gentleman. What a gentleman. Hey, straight for the stairs. Besides, um. besides, I think we'll find out that every second meal is free. Or oh, with these babies. Oh my God. <laughs> that is clever. Mm. Hey, would you like Two that? for one Fantastic babies. Deal. Oh, no, yeah. Yeah. It is. Not just a pretty face, me. If you take if over from me, if, if, you, if you take yeah, over from me, not too, you're going to find out that my uh, unlimited supply of two for one vouchers, just the tip of the iceberg. Ooh. Boom. <laughs> perks. Management perks. Hey, tell them, hang on, Rich. Tell them how many you've got in your cupboard at work. I've got 246 of those yep. in my desk. Well, I've seen a play before, and it was three hours. Oh, Jesus. Three hours. Oh. I don't want to stand in these shoes. It'll fly by, people. It'll fly by. <laughs> yeah, for you. It's a dub of speed. Right in the fucking open, though. Right in the open. Nobody giving a fuck. Oh, good. My troops settle down. This is going to be fucking wank. <laughs> <laughs> No one should say Bob Braley's crane when he could have kept going. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sam. <laughs> Fucking Bonjo. Right, if you sit down here, love. No, no, closer. 
poor smell. She should just leave. Like, see, by sitting watching it, you're like, you're saying it's okay. Fucking walk up and leave in the middle of it. Fuck him. Excuse me. Excuse me, Excuse me. mate. Come on. Hey, what's wrong? You know what's wrong. You know what's wrong, mate. You've got a girlfriend. She, she likes you. Yeah. Why else has she not come to the party? I mean, the balls on him to go to the after party. Fucking hell, mate. Actually, went to the after party. After that. I was gonna tell her anyway, wasn't I? Not like that. I just feel dead tight. This is Christmas, eh? Mm. Yeah, bloody Christmas, mm. eh? Women, mm. cigars, brandy. <laughs> cigars? Men, you can throw a stick at, <laughs> eh? <laughs> you know, I'd love to spend every Christmas Eve like this out. Right. Oh. Wouldn't it be lovely? It would be. Look at Willie's face. Like, mm. That's a bloody grand idea. Yeah. Well, I tell you what, why not? Why not? We, huh? we can make a date of every year. Oh. Every Christmas Eve. Yeah. Oh, well, you, okay. me, huh? you. Hang on. Right. What's the frigging matter? I don't need any more time. You haven't put me under bridge. You know what? You're a bloody wonderful bloke with me, you are. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I really, I really fucking mean that. Yeah, you've been nothing but a good man to me. And I, oh. I'd love to do your job. I'd love to do this promotion shit. You know, I want to do it, and I want to do it well. I'll take the job. I'll do it. I'll do the job. I'll take the oh, job. Oh, he's taking a job? I'll take the friggin' He's taking a job? Of course I'll take the bloody job. Oh, my God. He's taking it! Oh! Woohoo! Manager Richard Woodford. Oh, it smells coming to the party. Excuse me, is this Faye's house? Yeah. Oh. It smells at the party. <gasps> Bedroom. Oh, no. Oh, no. The thing is, smell fits right into it, does she? The way she's dressed. Fits right in. Take a tea. Excuse me. What the fuck? Practicing. Practicing again. He's my boyfriend, he's not your boyfriend. Wait, where is? You don't know. So, that was episode two of This Is London 88, right? In poor smell. So, smell walks into the change rooms, catches them kissing Faye. Right? He kind of speaks off his rehearsing. He does the play. Smells not stupid, right? She knows. And he's got the fucking balls after that to go to the after party. Right? The after party. Immediately after, he, instead of going and mocking it, okay with smell, he goes to after party, and smell catches him. Where's caught him? And then immediately he's like, I'm sorry, smell, I love you, I love you. Really, mate? Really? Because like two minutes ago, literally 30 seconds ago, you were in some dust. Like, and she's confused because he's crying about smell leaving, then she kind of thought that was what he wanted. She, Faye, thought she almost got to leave smell for him. And then, I think I'm doing to it. He's like, smell all over you. And Faye's like, Faye, excuse me, motherfucker. But I was, um, so the play is done. Um, Wall goes and visits Combo in prison. Like, she should have been visiting him. She should have been visiting him a lot for what he did. But I guess he's a reminder, right? The same way I the corpse of our dad in combo is another reminder of what they did. And I guess um, the baby, Lisa, is also a constant reminder about what she did, right, to Woody, right? So she goes, she goes and visits combo and they kind of has moments, right? And you can see the change in combo, right? You see, see um, the This Is England movie. You see him milky and a girl 
walking on the street and Combo's like asking Milky to a party with him. Asking Milky, by the way, and the other girl as well, because he wanted to separate them, right? Because black guy, white girl, Combo wanted them separated because he didn't believe in that stuff. And then fast forward a few years, a lot of showing a picture of a black baby, her baby, and he's like a massive smiley face. And he's genuinely happy for that, right? And that shows you how far the guys come, right? Before he might have put up a fake smile or no smile. But he's genuinely happy and it shows you that Combo has turned the fucking corner. And good for him, right? He's in prison, he's at peace, he's doing time, but he said such a shit life anyway that prison's not a big deal, right? It's not much worse than the outside for him, I guess. And at least he's there for a decent reason. He can wake up every morning and go to bed every morning knowing why he's there, right? And I'll get him through the day. Fellas. That's about that, right? For the like the important stuff, I think. Yeah. Um Law went to visit the 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 nurse and apologize for her behaviour and quite fucking right, because that was disgusting. And then the nurse says, Can I and I think that's like um as hell episode episode one was Law really, really struggling. Episode two, she's kinda coming together a little bit, right? She's coming, kind of getting herself together. I guess Milky being back for a bit of support, even though she doesn't want him, is going to be a help. Um, Buck, I had a day out with the team, with the gong. He's got to help her. Like Kelly has got no bad feelings towards her, right? All that stuff. And I guess, hopefully, episode three, we're going to see Lol. The Lol Buck. And Woody, Woody, Woody is, is, Slowly, slowly gone down the management route, right? But, like, he's doing the job already, right? So, mate, you may as well take the money. Ah, like, you'd have to be a dickhead to be a manager. You're doing the job, take the money. Like, but I don't think how many girls got lost. How many, for her name is, no, it's near. Because, like, she's not her money. She's, she's, the girlfriend he thinks he should be. She's not the girlfriend that he needs. Right? But was episode two of This Is England 88 or one minute episode in this season. And then we're at 90. And like, comment, subscribe. See, I was also pushing the notification bell, but there's nobody doing that, is there? Yeah, like nobody fucking pushes notification bells. But this little thing here, subscribe. subscribe. I think, is it here? And I will catch you in the next one.